Are there parts of the cell that can contribute to neurodegeneration? So lysosomes are a part of the cell that regulates cell metabolism to maintain its health by degrading waste material, but it also participates in more complex processes like tumor invasion or the immune response of the body. And we see the importance of the lysosomes when there is a mutation of one of the proteins. Uh, this is the origin of lysosomal storage disorders, which is a group of around 70 diseases. Uh, the one that I'm focusing on is Niemann Pick type A, where a lipid is accumulated inside the lysosome and causing a great variety of symptoms. One of the symptoms being the progressive loss of motor skills because of the loss of neurons in the cerebellum, the part of the brain that controls fine movement. And this is also a characteristic of more common neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's, where there is a loss of neurons primarily on the uh, memory center of the brain. And because lysosomes are in charge of degradation of material, we think that this is the origin of this different sensibility uh, in uh, neurodegeneration. It has been described that there are different types of lysosomes, even within the same cell, but no one has been able to specifically point out what are the difference between these uh, lysosomal subpopulations. So my research uh, focuses on identifying these lysosomal subpopulations using fluorescent probes so I can observe them by my microscopy. Using this approach, we can identify uh, the proteins that are present uh, in these lysosomal subpopulations of neurons that are more susceptible to the cellular stress, but also identify the lysosomes that are present in the neurons that are more resistant. And hopefully with this, we can uh, generate new uh, therapeutic approaches of these diseases.